Today, we've got some incredibly exciting news to share with you, Sander's new bill has officially been signed, and it's bringing not one, not two, but three direct payments. Plus, if you're on social security, you're in for a treat because those payments are arriving on the 23rd of September. We'll start by breaking down the key provisions of the bill, so you have a clear understanding of what's in it and how it aims to provide much-needed financial relief. We'll discuss who qualifies for these three direct payments. It's important to know if you're eligible, so you don't miss out on this opportunity. We'll provide a step-by-step -step guide on how to check your bank to make sure you're ready to receive the payments when they hit your account. We've done our research, gathered the facts, and we're here to provide you with a comprehensive and clear breakdown of everything you need to know about this exciting development. Welcome to Money Matters, your go-to channel for all things stimulus check updates and social security. In the realm of social security, the annual cost of living adjustment, COLA, forecast is akin to a financial lifeline for millions of Americans. In recent years, we've seen unprecedented COLA increases, 5, 9% in 2022 and a staggering 8, 7% in 2023, driven primarily by the economic turbulence caused by the COVID-19 pandemic. These substantial raises provided much-needed relief to retirees and social security beneficiaries who found themselves grappling with rising living costs. However, as we peer into 2024, the picture appears to be evolving. The latest data from the Labor Department suggests that inflation, though still a concern, might not surge as dramatically as it did in previous years. Enter Mary Johnson, a respected policy analyst at the Senior Citizens League. She's been closely monitoring the economic landscape and has recently revised her COLA forecast to incorporate a surge in August inflation rates. This adjustment, while tempering expectations somewhat, still keeps beneficiaries on track to receive an above-average raise in 2024. The COLA mechanism within Social Security is nothing short of essential. It serves as a safeguard against the eroding effects of inflation on fixed incomes. Without these annual adjustments, the purchasing power of Social Security benefits would gradually diminish as prices continue to climb across the broader economy. A prime example of this phenomenon is the striking fact that $100 in August 2013 is equivalent to a purchasing power of $131.28 in August 2023, as per the Labor Department's calculations. So, as we eagerly await the COLA announcement for 2024, it's crucial to stay informed about these developments. For many retirees and beneficiaries, Social Security is a cornerstone of their financial well-being. The COLA forecast is not just a number. It represents the potential for stability and relief in an ever-changing economic landscape. Within the intricate world of Social Security, the annual cost of living adjustment, or COLA, wields immense influence over the financial destinies of countless individuals and families across the nation. At its core, the size of this vital adjustment is intricately linked to the ebbs and flows of the Consumer Price Index for Urban Wage Earners and Clerical Workers, CPIW, a comprehensive and meticulously tracked metric encompassing over 200 spending categories. This index essentially serves as a barometer for the cost of living, keeping a watchful eye on how prices evolve over time. The COLA calculation process is deceptively simple yet profoundly impactful. To determine the forthcoming year's COLA, a direct comparison is made between the average CPIW data from July, August, and September of the current year and the corresponding average from those same months in the prior year. Any percentage increase resulting from this meticulous comparison becomes the bedrock upon which the Social Security COLA for the following year is constructed. However, there's a pivotal caveat that keeps everyone on their toes, the Social Security Administration cannot officially lock in the COLA figure for 2024 until September's inflation data becomes available. This critical dataset is scheduled for release on October 12th, at 8.30 a.m. Eastern Time. The wait for this data is an anxiety-inducing period for both recipients and analysts alike, as it ultimately sets the stage for their financial futures. Now, let's shift our focus to the numbers. Mary Johnson, a seasoned policy analyst known for her astute insights into social security matters, has recently recalibrated her COLA forecast. Her latest projection anticipates social security benefits to increase by 3.2% in the upcoming year. This is a slight upward revision from her earlier forecast of 3.0%, while at first glance, a 
2% raise may appear modest, especially in the shadow of the substantial 8.7% COLA bestowed upon beneficiaries in the previous year. It's important to contextualize this figure. A 3.2% increase still sales comfortably above the 20-year average of 2.6%, highlighting the continued significance of these annual adjustments in preserving the financial security and purchasing power of social security beneficiaries. The impending 3.2% cost of living adjustment, COLA, for social security benefits in the coming year is generating both hope and concern within the realm of retirement and financial planning. While it offers a welcomed financial reprieve for beneficiaries, it's crucial to delve into the broader context. The fact that this figure slightly trails the 3.3% COLA assumed by the Board of Trustees in their recent examination of Social Security's financial health is significant. The Social Security Program, a cornerstone of financial security for countless retirees, is facing a mounting funding challenge. A critical tipping point looms on the horizon, potentially necessitating benefit cuts as early as 2034 to sustain the system's solvency. The gap between the COLA assumed by the trustees and the actual COLA can have a substantial impact on the program's financial viability. An unexpectedly generous COLA in 2024 could accelerate the timeline for these necessary changes. We've seen this scenario play out before. The colossal 8.7% COLA awarded in 2023, driven by the highest inflation rates in four decades, triggered discussions and actions that could have far-reaching consequences for Social Security's future. These adjustments, while essential for addressing funding shortfalls, can have direct implications for the financial well-being of retirees who depend on these benefits as a crucial source of income in their later years. The latest update from the Social Security Administration, SSA, reveals a substantial increase in the average monthly payment for retired workers. This financial boost has seen the average monthly payment rise from $1,681 to an estimated $1,827 a remarkable increase of $146 per month for individuals relying on Social Security as a critical source of income during retirement. This uptick can make a meaningful difference in their financial well-being. The implementation of this increase commenced in January 2023 for those who receive standard Social Security benefits, while individuals on Supplemental Security Income SSI, began to experience these changes a bit earlier, starting on December 30, 2022. The timing of these adjustments is significant, as they align with the beginning of the year, offering beneficiaries a fresh start with enhanced financial security. However, it's vital to grasp that the much-anticipated 8.7% cost-of-living adjustment, COLA, for 2023 doesn't uniformly apply to all Social Security recipients. Thank you for joining me, your go-to channel for all things stimulus checks and personal finance tips. And don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.